In this tutorial, we are going to learn about how to draw a line on the GUI of C hash. The IDE which we are using is the Microsoft Visual Studio. So how we can do that? First you need to click on File, then on New and then on Project. After select Visual C hash and click on Windows Forms application and then click on OK. OK now this is your GUI main window. What you need to do is to like uh, take one panel okay panel in control box so we will search for it that either it is there yes it is there okay drag it out and make it a little bit big okay so that it will cover your what's called is the form the whole form okay like this now we need to do one thing and that is that we have to double click this panel one okay and when when uh, we, we we will click or even without click okay it will get executed the code will get executed okay so, so we will write the code for our line creation so so there is one class that is called as the graphics okay so we have to we have to make one what's called as the variable of this very of this class okay so this gra is the is the variable of the, that belongs to graphics class okay so now there is one sub module that is called as this okay so this is this and this dot this dot okay now we need to do one thing that we will write this dot panel one this dot panel one dot create graphics okay now create graphics is a method or function this dot panel one dot create graphics panel one is uh, our control okay and dot create graphics is a method or function so after this is done you need to write a semicolon or terminator okay okay after this is done okay now we need to do one more thing okay so what we need to do is to define a class that is called as the pen okay and we write black pen here which is actually the what is called as the variable of this pen class is equal to pen black pen is equal to new pen color dot black now in parameter insertion brackets we have we have two things one is the size of the line okay means that what will be the size of the line which this pen will draw okay this pen function now this this is a function and color dot black property will decide what is the color of this uh, line will be okay so we, we 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 can write red orange or anything okay and then after all this is done all the things are all this data stored inside this variable that is black pen now for line is we know that it there must be two points so so we have to define two points at least okay so now we will write point f okay and what is point f actually it is the floating points these are the floating points which are in the ordered pair like it is not a single integer okay it is in the form of ordered pair like 2 comma 3 or like this that is both x and y okay so our first is p and t1 this is variable of point a variable that is pnt1 you can write anything instead of this pnt1 these are just the variable names so here we will write new point f new point point f okay, now we will write 100 comma 0 f and 100 comma 0 f okay we can we can write like this okay 100 comma 0 f 100 point zero f okay and we will write the second one as 
okay 500 and uh, like 200 okay so this is the second point point two and uh, this is 100 and this must be 200 okay and this can be like 500 so these are the two points okay now okay now this is our main variable okay that is the gray which belongs to the graphics class and now we have defined two points that is pnt1 and pnt now we will write gra dot draw line okay draw line okay dot graphics dot graphics dot draw line gra dot graphics dot draw line and we have to insert three parameters inside it so which one one is black pen black pen comma pnt1 comma pnt2 okay so this thing we will write e and it will give us lines okay so this is our line okay so so you can see it okay so so if we want to change its parameters or length we can do it by changing the points okay so in this way you can draw the line on the CH. so hopefully you got the concept so thanks for visiting our channel and don't forget to subscribe